Itachi Uchiha, probably the best prodigy of all time in the Hidden Leaf Village and one of the fan favorites in Naruto. He is for sure, someone who needs a whole video about him and his story. Enjoy! Only at the age of seven he got out of academy becoming one of the youngest genin after Kakashi, the three legendary Sanins and Yamato. Got a Sharingan at eight years old after the death of his teammate Team Azumo and still before turning nine got it with three Tomo. Unlike other Uchihas, Itachi tried to keep active his Sharingan the whole time lowering the energy needed and getting a better mastery of it. He came a few years later at Tenet Chunin confirming his title of Itachi of the Sharingan. Just one year later he joined the Umbu as its youngest member, assigned to the Team Ro, where he started knowing Kakashi and at 13 years old got promoted to Umbu captain. Itachi seeing when he was young the third great ninja war, wanted peace in the village at any cost. At first he and Shursui wanted to use Koto Amatsukami on the Uchiha clan leaders, but his eye was stolen by Danzo before they could do it. Shursui entrusted his other eye to Itachi while falling and drowning into the river making also Itachi's Manjikyu Sharingan awaken. Here Itachi got two choices, support the Uchihas, getting the whole clan, including Sasuke, killed or kill his whole clan saving Sasuke. Before proceeding he met Abito, at the time known as Madara, who left him to kill all the Uchiha, saying nothing to Sasuke making him want vengeance against him making him even stronger. After this Itachi entered the Akatsuki, Tobi's organization, keeping the third Hokage informed about the Akatsuki and their plans. Until his last fight Itachi had to keep secret his real intentions to Sasuke, only later revealed by Abito, to keep him wanting to get stronger. Itachi died against Sasuke due to his illness, probably caused by the overuse of his Manjikyu Sharingan. He also had a role in the fourth great ninja war, he saved and helped Naruto in Killer Beat but mainly with Sasuke fought Kabuto using his Anami on him, which makes a scene repeat itself forever until who it was used against accept his fate. Here is where Itachi's story ends, if you enjoyed and like this video make sure to subscribe and also let me know in the comments if I should do a video about all of his abilities. See you in the next video.